Hello everyone, it's Grandma Jackie and I'm back with another video. This is take two because I messed up before. I forgot to turn on my airplane mode and my phone was just going nuts. And it was too distracting for me. I cannot keep up. Look what I did with that Dollar Tree sign. Isn't that cool? Love it. I hope my thing's not moving around too much because I'm on a new tripod and it the legs are kind of flimsy. I don't know. Anyways, let's do this again. Thank you so much for joining me. It is a rainy Monday. I just babysat um, Gracie and Riley for a little bit while their mommy went to work because they don't start school till tomorrow. But um, we didn't do much of anything. We just watched movies. Movies that they haven't seen before, which I was surprised. Let me just, let me just say this. <clears throat> we watched Homeward Bound 2. We watched Honey, I Shrunk the Kids. We watched Flubber. And we watched Turner and Hooch. <laughs> so I can't believe they've never seen that. But anyways, let's get started. Thank you again. Like I said, so much for joining me. Sorry for this pile over here, but we're going to move through it. I'm going to do cleaning supplies first. This is my favorite Fabuloso with the vinegar. I love the smell of it. I love mopping my floors with this. Absolutely love it. <clears throat> then I seen this and it was new. And what caught my eye was lavender, vanilla, and thyme scent with its essential oils so I don't know about that I don't know how you work this but now I'm thinking wow that's essential oils Whew. you just turn this little thing on here look at that and then you spray it that's definitely, oh, I can smell the, um, I don't smell lavender, I don't smell vanilla, I smell the, the thyme part of it. Is that how you say that, thyme? Mm. Oh, never mind this right here. I thought it was just a little area, and I was messing with it, and I actually think it was a skin tag, and so I've done it to myself. <laughs> okay, so I got the spray bottle of the Comet Foam Cleanser, but then... I found the refill of it too. I got that. I love cleaning my bathtub with this and my shower do. And then I found a refill for the kitchen cleaner with bleach. I have a Comet now that I'm using. I think it's just a regular spray Comet, but I can always use it. This is the refill for it. Then I grabbed four boxes of these little toilet cleaning gels. I've tried these before. I don't think they last long. I don't think I tried this brand, but um, I don't know. I just thought I'd try it. They were there. And there are 14 in there with a little dispenser. So there's that. And then I got like all the um, Mike and Ike stuff for the kids. So I got the two different sets of the crayons. And then this gel pen set. And they smell. And then two of these. So I thought I would give this to one set of grandkids. And then I have, um, I can't reach it, the Care Bear Collection too. So I did get two of those as well. Then this set. And the big thing of crayons. And then the bigger crayons, but then also I found this for the Care Bear collection. So I got all those. And then I <clears throat> also got two of these for the Fruit Loop collection. This pen set, the big crayons, and the big pack of crayons. So I got the Fruit Loops, the Mike and Ike, and the Care Bears. So just for the, like the kiddos or whatever. And then I went ahead and picked up a couple of these little highlighter things. I just thought the kids might like them. Or I could put them in with their um, birthdays. Which, let's see. Charlotte's birthday I've already got. Riley's birthday's already over. So Gracie and Chase and Lila's birthdays are coming up. So it's got these little highlighters, 
much or so cute like maybe chase this and crazy this or something I don't know Riley was trying to get me to put on the TV some of my videos I think she was trying to figure out what all I got everybody for birthdays coming up and also like I'm starting to pick up some Christmas stuff so I think she that's why she's interested in watching that oh and also <clears throat> she knows that I also pick up stuff for the grandma fun basket so she's probably like mm, I'm gonna pre look at this okay this is emergency gummies immune support with 750 milligrams of vitamin C orange tangerine and raspberry I thought this was a pretty darn good deal and you know you got all that that stuff coming up where you got to start really taking care of yourself enough said right okay so I thought I'd pick that up then I also got some moisture sauce if that's how you say it a1 sauce which we've already had to get into those two and then I also got some soy sauce because I cleaned out my refrigerator the other day and all that stuff was expired. So the next time I went to the Dollar Tree, I found it all. Like, why not? So, restocking on all that. <clears throat> then over here, anytime I find this Hormel pepperoni, I pick it up because we like making those homemade pizzas. You can put these in salads. You can just have them for like little Lunchables. So, they're not the best thing in the world for you, but if you're going to get them, you might as well get them as cheap as the Dollar Tree, right? <clears throat> so then I wanted to try these as well as these, I don't even know how to say the name of this, so I'm not going to, but it's the Korean barbecue noodles. This has a lot of sodium in it, so I don't get this stuff very often. I don't need it. <laughs> I love it. I love the taste of it, but I do not need it. So, um, and the date on this is 6 1 of 24. And I always like shop the food section. Really, really shop the food section. Candies. These are restocked from my candy jars that I have in the kitchen. This is chocolate covered caramels. And these Wiley Wallaby soft chews. You guys know this is like a repeat by for sure. I always get the classic red and the green. Sometimes I get that like raspberry purpley color. I do not like the cinnamon one. It's way too cinnamony. My husband likes it. I do not. Anyways, that's a restock of my candy things. This is also a repeat buy because I like these sandwich bags and I think that it's a good deal for 40 bags. I wouldn't use these for freezer bags, but they're good for lunches. So there's 40 bags in here. This is zip lock bags and it's a double zipper. So that's a good deal. All right. I got more food back here. Yes. I got some gummy clusters of nerds. I think I'm going to put this in the grandma fun basket. Then I got some muffins. And the dates on these was really good, so that's why I picked up a few. We don't eat this very often. So, let's see. Where's my dates? Uh, November 23rd of 2024. So, I got two of the blueberry where you just add milk and one of the banana nut where you just add milk. You don't have to make these as muffins, especially if you get like two packs. You can put it in like a, a little banana loaf pan or whatever. Uh, banana loaf, banana bread pan, little bread pan. That's what I'm trying to say. And just make it into like a little delicious slice of bread. Oh. <clears throat> So then I started picking up some more bows. So I got a purple one here and a pretty blue. And it just comes with, of course, the bow, the curly ribbon, and then also this ribbon that goes with it. So I picked a couple of bows. Then also I got some pom-poms, <clears throat> which are great for whatever. It shows 
like a little rabbit on there so you can do little rabbit tails you can stack these and make little snowmen and glue them together and make little faces whatever so I just got it to have in the shed for crafts because I know that's coming up then I got a gift card holder which I thought was really cute and simple um, I kind of want to make Christmas less stressful for everyone involved including myself <laughs> this year so that's part of it that is part of it I did get a couple calendars I got this follow that dream calendar for 2024 it just shows you like the little ones on there and then the scenic beauty which I think I've got something like this before for a different year which you can't go wrong with with that so I just need a couple calendars in the house <clears throat> I've been collecting for my Crayola um, baskets for the kids for Christmas um, so I got actually got three of these and Lila's already got into one so one each for each of the Crayola baskets I should have got three but and kept three it says it won't color on your skin furniture or fabric and it's great for on the go and colors only on the special paper which is true it's a, it's a blessing it is a blessing then I got more stickers because she's just been loving stickers so I want to keep this in stock um, this is fairy tale princess coloring and sticker book activities and this one is the Beauty and the Beast one. Very pretty. They come with, like I said, stickers. But then also there's like coloring pages and things like that in there. So I grabbed a couple of these for Lila to keep her busy. More of the Crayola goodness. They have these Crayola pencil bags. They have the yellow the kind of reddish orange, the blue, and the green. Then I found a Crayola um, puzzle. It's 24 pieces, kind of in a blue set. I thought that would be good in one of the Crayola baskets that I make. I got some stickers. I don't think that's all of them, but this is the new. I have not picked this up yet, so I wanted it for my collection. And then also, I got another set of Flamingo Freds. So I just grabbed a couple stickers. It's not like I need stickers or anything, so that's why I'm like kind of been away getting away from them for a while. <laughs> did get a bunch of ribbon got one of each color and it is nine feet long and it just says it's a stitch ribbon so I'll kind of show you the colors the purple the reddish orangish brown and a blue just to have in my shed for crafts then I get this to put on Lila's little desk in there but for her for her little collection of pins and things she's got going in there <clears throat> these two things kind of go together well here's another cookie thing I got some of these mini chessman butter pep pepperidge farm cookies really good but these two things kind of go together it is a sticky note set Kind of got like that, and then also like a pencil case, so they kind of match. I really like that. Um, let's see, so it opens like on this side, you can put some erasers in there, some pens or pencils in there, and then it opens on the other side, and it's just 
one long thing there. So I got this as a set for someone. Then they had these containers out again with these different lids and I like the shape of them. So it's kind of a longer container and there are three in here. So they nest inside of each other. These are the best to get and they last you for a long time. Then I finally found the egg holder and it's a shelf that you can put in the refrigerator. So it just goes like this on your shelf. You put your eggs in there, pull it out. Finally found one of those. I've been on look lookout for those for a while. <clears throat> then I just grabbed a gray, it's gonna be like a drawer organizer. So I just grabbed it. Oh, and this, this was something new. This is acrylic note board. And I'm not real sure how it works, but I guess you could like write on it with marker or something. I'm not sure what color marker, but it's got the little base in here. Let's open this up because this is intriguing. I haven't really seen one of these before, so looks like this. But it comes with one of these, so... Oh, I got it. So this is kind of like what stands it up. So you can either stand it up on this side or stand it up on this side. All right? Yes. I like that. Now, it's, it's going to be interesting to see like what I can write on it with and what it looks like. And I'll set that off to the side because I'm going to check that out. <clears throat> So I got this wooden wreath base. It's just a circle. I feel like it's not really wooden. It's like a pressed wood, maybe. Yeah, pressed wood. But it says it's 12 inch by 12 inch. So I thought maybe I could do something with that out there. Then I got Lila another thing of um, paper plates for her snackies. We just use the, the fancy little colorful paper plates from the Dollar Tree. There are 16 in here and it's worth it for her. So there's that. Um, for my grandson, my youngest grandson, I've been picking stuff up um, that has to do with like Sesame Street because that's kind of when I want to base his Christmas around is Sesame Street. So I picked him up a nightlight that has the famous characters on there. Cookie Monster, Oscar, and Elmo. Then I got this one, and it's, I always have problems with this, and, and people have told me in the comments, Abby Kadabby, I think, and then Oscar the Grouch. So I've got a little collection of these going on for him for his Christmas. Then I seen this and I was like, this is kind of cute. It's a two pack of toddler dental kit. And it's got like this little one that's got the bigger handle and then this one they could put their fingers through. So I'm gonna put that in, probably his stocking or something like that. Um, Let's see, let's do two more things and we're gonna have to end this because it's already longer than I wanted it to. Um, I got this little jot set that is sticky notes. I think it goes like this. Yes. So I'll grab that. And then this shirt. And it is a, it says large. And it looks fairly large, but it's a long sleeve yellow. I just grabbed it thought maybe we can put something on it um, for the grandkids or whatever so anyways thank you all so much for joining me and I'm probably going to have to haul some more because you see all that sitting on my table in there so after I put all this stuff up and kind of enjoy the day a little bit maybe I'll get back to hauling again so I hope you all have a great day I hope the weather's nice in your area you're getting out you're getting some fresh air you're enjoying yourself because summer's almost over in this area. School, like I said, starts tomorrow. So please stay safe, take care, 
and have a good day. I'll catch you later.